The foods women eat could be tied to their risk of infertility, a new study from Australia finds. Researchers found that eating fast food regularly was linked to a two-fold increase in the risk of infertility in women of childbearing age. What's more, not eating enough fruit was tied to a 50% increase in infertility risk, and eating fruit several times a day appeared to reduce the amount of time it took to conceive. The study found only an association between diet and infertility, however, more research is needed to prove that certain foods have a direct impact on infertility risk. Future of Fertility Treatment, 7 Ways Baby Making Could Change, Dr. Raj Mothar, Secretary of the British Fertility Society, who was not involved in the study, said that the new study is useful for clinicians and women who are looking to start trying to conceive. It is in keeping with other pieces of research, which show that your overall dietary pattern may influence fertility, Mothar told Live Science. The message from these studies seems to be that processed foods are bad, and fresh fruit and vegetables are good, for fertility, the research. Published today, May 3, in the journal Human Reproduction, included nearly 5,600 women, ages 18 to 43, from Australia, New Zealand, the UK, and Ireland, all of whom were in the early stages of their first pregnancy. The wives looking after these women were instructed to interview them about their diet in the month before they conceived and in addition, to record how long it took the women to get pregnant once they started trying. Couples are considered infertile when they are unable to conceive, within a year of trying, according to the study. So, although all the women involved in the study were pregnant, 8% of them fell into the infertile category, as it took them a longer than a year to get pregnant. The major finding is that the risk of infertility, that is, taking longer than 12 months to conceive went from 8% for all the women in the cohort to 12% in women with the lowest fruit intake, said lead study author Claire Roberts, a senior research fellow at Robinson Research Institute at the University of Adelaide in Australia. That jump, from 8% to 12%, represents a 50% increase in risk of infertility, Roberts added, infertility read full story more health.